Hi everyone, it's Veet from Veet's Vegan Cooking School and I'm back with um, tips at 2.10. Yesterday I was away, actually I was away camping for um, two nights and camping, if anyone knows me well, you know that camping is my favourite thing to do. And of course when I'm camping, food is super important. So the tip that I'm talking about today is what to do when you go camping for a few days. So if you saw um, the last Facebook Live. Is anyone there? Please let me know if you are and write in the comments whether you like camping or not. And in the last Facebook Live I did, um, I talked about the sandwich that I took camping on the picnic and it was a um, egg, you know, it was a um, vegan egg sandwich. So we had that organized and for lunch we uh, had crackers and cheese and salad. And then for dinner, what I did, and this is the tip, is the night before I cooked my favorite thing at the moment, which is borscht soup. And I've got a picture here of the borscht. Uh, I'm looking at the picture. I want to keep looking at you. I tried to learn from my cameraman the other day. And that recipe is on my website at www.veets.com.au. So that's just V E E T S dot com dot A U. I cooked up that and I cooked up enough so that we could eat it that night before we went camping. I cooked up enough so I could have three portions in the freezer because I love it so much. And then I cooked up enough to take one and a half of these jars camping with us. So our first night we had my favorite meal, which was borscht, yum. So that was our first meal. And I'd got some frozen curry and dal in the freezer. So I took that, put that in the esky and that kept everything really nice and cool. Um, for people who aren't, don't live in Australia, an esky is a chiller box if you're in New Zealand. I think you call it an ice box in the States. I'm not sure, let me know. And what do you call it in England? Anyway, it's that thing that keeps food cool. So we had our borscht, our curry, and we had cashew cheese that I'd made. And what was the most amazing thing? Oh, and for breakfast, Mac had bread and his normal things. And I had fruit salad and, and I also had a few crackers and the cashew cheese I made. And then what was the most amazing thing is this. We came back from camping with this much rubbish. That's it. It's all compost. So it's from a fruit salad. It's our tea bags. It's my dandelion tea. So we didn't have copious amounts of rubbish to bring back or rubbish bags to deal with. I was just able to put it in one of these jars. Isn't that great? So good. So it's so good to have, if you do go camping or away for a few days and you've got to take the food, think about what you can freeze and what you can take and cook the night before something that you really love and that you want to eat, eat it that night and then take it with you camping. Okay, it looks like no one's watching me. Maybe it's a weird time, but I hope you watch at some time. And please share this um, share and check out the recipe for the borscht um, soup. And I'll put the uh, link for that. And I'll also put the link for those sandwiches that I talked about in the last um, video because they were so good. So um, maybe I can say I'm glad to be home, but you know what? I'd rather still be camping. <laughs> I love camping. We saw the most amazing wildlife and we saw beautiful trees. So for anyone who does watch this far, I'll tell you what we saw. We saw goannas and paddy melons, which are tiny, tiny marsupials. Well, like tiny kangaroos for those people who don't know what paddy melons are. And they were the red necked ones. Oh, they were gorgeous. We saw birds, we saw a dingo, and we saw the most amazing fig trees and beech trees. And of course, my favorite tree, eucalyptus. So I'll be back tomorrow at 2.10 with another cooking tip. And I hope you enjoyed the camping tip. And please share this if you like it and you think others will. Okay, bye, lots of love, bye. Oh, someone's there, so I have to say hello. I can't see, let me put my glasses on, see who it is. Hi, Maura, thank you for watching. And I hope you enjoy um, the tips that I shared on camping. And it's not just for camping, it's if you go away for a few days. All right, bye-bye.